Well, hello everybody, so I am here with Dave in UK, and we're having some fun. Um, I you got this... You rephrase that. Why? <laughs> it sounded really bad. Whatever, whatever. Let's do this. Alright. So I've got this road in... Uh, I'm going to be calling this a, a Levy Sphere double pulse motor from now on. And uh, I've got this coil. I've got another coil. And I'm just sitting in on top of this thing while it's levitating. And I'm just arcing things, and things are flying off the table. I got 24 volt power supply instead of 12. Coil's getting hot, chips are getting hot, things are frying, so I thought I'd film. Alright, let's set this up. Alright, that's pretty good. It's leaning a little, hold on. There we go. Alright, spin her up. Uh, where's my power? I don't even know what happened. Are we still hot? I turned. I unplugged it. Where are my cords at? <laughs> there we go. This is it. Let's go. Nope. Oh, good. Oh, my power. All right, hold on. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just going to short this coil out against this wire and it's going to produce an arc and a needle fear is probably going to go flying. <laughs> and things are burning. Oh, yeah, that is violent. <laughs> Alright, shorting it out now. <laughs> okay, let's get this light bulb connected to this thing. Yeah, show them some flashing. All right. So I got a 120 volt light bulb here. I don't know what the water is. 120 volt. And I'm gonna connect it to this thing and see if we can light it up. dimmer than the other one. Whee. There you go. 120 volt light bulb. Hey, that's so yeah, that one's on. Try this again. So they were levitating, bouncing a little. High speed. And, uh, we're down. All right. Light bulb. Oh, I didn't get it. Didn't get it. Come on. Oh yeah! Ah! Oh, time out! <laughs> Things are flying everywhere. Eject! Eject! Okay. Let's try it again. Try it again. In the hole. Get in the hole. Do the man. <laughs> Check it out. It's floating and uh, and working and at the same lightning. time. Power off, getting hot, time to cool off, time out. Okay, Dave, what do we do next? You want to short, short this little coil out again? Yeah, show them the little coil with All the right. uh, light bulb, because that'll... Yeah, that'll, that'll, that'll let her up. All right, let's see here. Just a little light bulb. Mind you, this is a 120-volt bulb. <laughs> it's lighting it up with ease. It's 
probably like a 15 watt or something. And, and after you've done this, you can take the light bulb away and oh. replace it with the cat. I take it back. <laughs> I take it back. 75 watts. This is a 75 watt bulb. Come yeah, out. The, the fact that you're burning about 400 watts from the power supply. <laughs> no, nobody has to know that. Okay, hold on. I mean, uh, I mean, 14 watts. Yeah. As verified on the oscilloscope. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. Man, it's cool as one. And that thing's fast. That 24 volts. Come on, what happened? Something fry? What do you want to do? Hook up a cap real quick? No, I said the cat. Oh, the cat. Snickers! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, how about a dead short test with this thing? This thing's crazy. I think if you use the cat, it would definitely be a dead short. <laughs> oh, yeah. It's okay, though. The cat is famous. Like Hold on. Smell that. Okay, I'm gonna short out this coil. In three, two, one. Oh, oh well done. Yeah. No, the whole freaking thing is burning my hands. The whole coil is probably starting to melt. the oven. Oh yeah, it's an induction heater now. <laughs> okay, Dave. Now what? Um, what do we want to do? Put the uh, put the two coil. Oh, okay. <laughs> Why not? Right. Actually, put, I'll just put the put the one coil like clockwise and put one connected to the other coil anti-clockwise, so they're kind of canceling each other out, but with the bulb in okay. between. Okay, that's a good idea. Okay. I'll see here. It so probably I gotta, do nothing at all, but... <laughs> it should, I would think. So I got them in series, counterclockwise and clockwise, so both, both, they're both directions. Okay. With the bulb. Can we see the bulb if I set it down? Um, that's good. We'll just set it right here. How about that? Okay, firing up. Levitating, spinning at high speed, and we're back down. Do it again. I'm gonna hook up the bulb now. Nothing. Something's not right. Oh, I ain't got the ball. Hold on, it fell off. Ah! It lit up. Get, get, take, the, take the outside coil off, turn it over, and put it back on. Hold on, let me do that again. Shorting it out now. Oh. Yeah, okay, flip it over. Yeah, leave the connections as they are, but just turn the coil over. Yeah, I'll turn the inside one. Yeah, whichever. Same thing. Alright. Man, this coil's getting hot. Yes, I love when things go correct. Melting plastic and burning coils and such. Alright. Get it going. Yeah. 
There's <laughs> plastic flying out. And shooting now! It wasn't as bright. Not as bright, but still. No. Which is kind of odd because now they're going the same direction. Yeah, the, the opposite way around produced the brighter shots backwards. Yeah, I know. Let's try it again. I was, I was leave it this way and do some more experiments. Okay, so right now, everybody, we're doing these windings are going the same direction. I've got one inside the other, and uh, it looked like it produced less light. Let's see if I can try to get it going good here. Steady does it. We're levitating. Stay there. Shorting out now. Yeah, something's not right at all. That's crazy. That's really strange. Let me flip it. Let me flip it back over. It killed it too. It's going a lot. Man, this stuff is hot. This thing's toaster oven today. It's a toaster oven. Okay, let's go. Toaster and a cat killer. <laughs> Come on, where you at? Shorting out now. Oh my god, yeah. That's crazy. Okay, everybody, I want to explain this real quick so you know what's going on. Just double check which way around those coils are actually going and which way around you got them wired. Alright. Okay. Right now. Right now, it looks like. Okay, maybe they are going the same direction now. Yeah. So they're going. They're going the when they're going the same direction. They're brighter. That makes more sense. But the, the, you could still have them connected backwards, so it would. Um. Like, you know, is the bottom of the one coil connected to the top of the other one? That would be. The oh same yeah, direction. yeah, it is. Uh, so. That's so I've got. Difference. Hold on. So I've got the the bulb connected to the inner coil, going clockwise, coming out. And then going clockwise. Yeah, so they're going the same direction yeah. right now. Oh, so they are, yeah. Yeah, same direction. So now we know that same direction is brighter than not the same direction. And, uh... And yet the opposite direction, which should have... The two coils should have cancelled each other out, more or less, actually stopped the Neo. Killed it. Yeah, faster. There we go. Let's, uh... Let's hook this back up. Alright. Here we go. See if I can get this thing steadier. Shorting out my balls now. Now that's bright. All right, let's just do some quick levitating at high speed. <laughs> the, uh, I was going to say the whole sensor needs to go a bit low. Yeah, I think why? It's a toaster oven, man. It's so hot. It's a V8. What do you want, kitty? Quit crying. Come over here and play. And that thing is like eating plastic. Great. Oh, just real quick. 
if I get it steady, I'm going to mark it again so we can show which way this is spinning. So, steady there. This coil is like burning my hands, it's so hot. Oh, maybe it's time for a break. <laughs> Okay, it's marked. I'm take it out. I'm gonna let you see how it was spinning. So check this out. All right, I'm showing the camera, Dave. So there, it's spun and it's going back to the center axis point, and then it's going back out. So it's kind of got a wobble, like a gyroscope does. But it's, oh, is it still got that precession thing? Yeah, it does. But here would be a north or a south there so it's close to it's not even directly over at this time and there would be the south so you can see it's off center this time so it's even Dave it's even at a worse wobble than it was before here I'll, sh I'll show you I think it's uh, riding around inside the plastic probably see where I circled it that's the pole it's, yeah. it's way over here man I'm literally things like radiating heat this is great because it's not quite steady but it's still first time I did it it was perfectly level straight all right um that's what I'm doing today me and David playing yeah whoa why that ah Ah. Okay, I feel like I'm in an oven. <laughs> I gotta go cook some meat. Okay, Dave. Thanks for Cooks. your. Thanks. For, what? That's a wrap. That was a wrap. Are you filming? No, but you are. Oh crap! Man, I'm serious. That is like burning my hand. This coil is like a. Like radiating some heat here, and my transistors aren't even very hot; they're almost cold. <laughs> All right, so here's what I got again, everybody. I got my circuit, 12 volt running my circuit, 24 volt to my transistors, double pulse motor, fan mod. Gotta love this thing. And uh, that's it. Any last words, Dave? Uh, so we're not gonna do the cat then. The cat? Yeah, the famous Tesla, Nikola Tesla cat electrocution experiment of 1897. Um, that I not many people know about. I think I might hang on to the cat for a while longer. Yeah, we should save it for the Ab, Ab Hattoris. <laughs> yes, which I just got done putting windings on. Yay! But not all of them, just another one. Alright, everybody, this is Russ. I've been your host today, and uh, Dave. Dave, you want me to tell him what your username is? Uh, you can do. Rave154. Mr. Dave, he's been helping me out every once in a while, doing some good stuff. Uh, donating some time. Alright, everybody. This is Russ. See ya.